<laughs> Thursday's Independent reports on yet more irritating behaviour from hysterical eco-halfwits, although other opinions may be available. <laughs> what do you think, Leo? So uh, this is a campaign called Just Stop Oil, uh, which even, even sounds uh, histrionic and, and screen. Yeah, it, um, it does, doesn't it? They really can. <laughs> just stop oil! <laughs> Mum, will you just stop oil, please? Uh, but the, anyway, they've, uh, these uh, green-haired... Uh, septum pierced half was stormed an oil terminal in Essex in a bid to cut off the petrol supply to the whole of South East England. I, mean, I bet it was more like drizzle than storm as well, yeah. to be honest. <laughs> yeah, I, mean, I should imagine one guy in a high vis jacket could batter the lot of them. I mean, they could just pick their moment. I mean, right. just pick your moment with this stuff. You know, you could have done it during COP26. You could yeah. do it in a few months when we've resolved all the all these issues. But at the moment, we've got an energy crisis. The cost of living is spiralling for, for working people. Uh, and Even their own protests are incoherent on that front because they're saying stop drilling for new oil and stop people, stop forcing people to choose between heating and eating. Well, the yep. whole point of the, of, the, of the heating price rises is that we are trying to make an expensive transition to a green economy. Not the whole yeah. point, but that was going to happen anyway. Yeah, yeah. You know? we're, we're moving in that direction yeah. anyway. And I guarantee that none of these 25 members of Just Stop Oil rode a horse. No. Where they're going, they, they would have used uh, well, petrol and oil to, to get there. They're wearing clothes made out of synthetic fibres, which are made from oil. Uh, the, the, everything, the electricity they're using is made from burning oil. Did, so, yeah. you read the comment, because I actually watched the whole interview with one of these uh, girls, and they've actually quoted her here. Hannah from Brighton said, I'm so scared, I'm 23, <laughs> and the only way people will listen to me is if I lock onto the pipework of a fueling station. Yeah. Just read that sentence back to yourself slowly. The only read. word yeah. she needs to change there is scared. <laughs> right. I'm Hannah, I'm 93, I'm so solipsistic, right, I'm right. so self-obsessed. Yeah, well, yeah. I mean, I, the only way that anyone will listen to me is I, I'm so pathetic, I'm so, I fail to add value to well, society. You know. I've got this crazy idea, do something that garners respect. Yeah. Or maybe get some elegance. <laughs> do something that will yeah. make someone listen. To you. Oh, and, and you're Hannah. right, the fact that they always look like Leo said, septum pierced, etc. Wouldn't you have more respect if one of them just showed up in a three piece suit and you'd be like, actually, they might be onto something? Because they do it to themselves. We just look and go, of course they think. I was talking about this. We had, did a show last week and there was a talk, I thought about Primark and so on, you know, single use clothing, or most people pay 10 quid for a shirt and it's, it's, it, you can't even get it through a single wash. You know, you wear it for a weekend and it's dead. <laughs> And it's terrible when they end up in landfill. I was saying, you know, the aristocracy, of which I consider myself to be an honorary member, <laughs> have had the solution to this for, for, for centuries. You know, I, I own shoes that are 20 years old. Right. Do Several, right I mean, in fact, I own more shoes that are more than 10 years old than not. The argument is uh, poor people tweet, can't tweet, do that. Jack, and yeah, no, you've got to save up a little bit. But that would be a great mm. way of doing it, actually. If you yeah. could arrange for payment schemes for people to buy brogues from proper cobblers. Can I just say one more thing? These people are lacking meaning in their lives and they need Jesus. That's all I'm going to say. Yeah. Uh, just a quick uh, plug. Uh, but they, they I do think need that is a perfect point of which to go to the first break. <laughs>